Today, we're stepping inside of Exeron, and uh, yeah, we're starting to see these more and more where people are opening their doors for the first time, showing off their technology. Extremely grateful for that. Here in Germany, we have a machine to talk about, but I have a question to ask you. How much do you spend on tooling, and how much would you save if you saved about 70% of that? We're going to step inside to learn more about that story on a do-all machine from aluminum to steel to graphite and even grinding. So yes, come inside where Adrian is waiting for us to learn more about this story. As promised, as advertised, I got Adrian inside. We're going to talk about that tooling savings that I promised you, but it all stems from quality. And we think about Exeron, quality is the very first thing we think of. It's the echelon of quality. We call it submicron, but we got more news about that as well. And knowing that Exeron is German made and within 100 kilometers, 80% of their partners are right here. Let's dive into those details. Adrian, I've already promised the audience, I've already told them I have great news on their tooling. Let's start with this idea and this number of saving 70%. Where did this come from? Uh, it, it was a, a, a very nice uh, story because uh, we deliver an Impini 9 machine like, like, like this one, and uh, the customer wanted to cut with oil. So he started to cut with oil and uh, graphite. So um, this is not a, this is not a, not new, uh, but the customer called us and told us, you know, I'm saving. I mean, and 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 a month later, and told us, you know, I'm saving like ten between ten and twenty percent uh, tool cost. Two months after, and then uh, well, we were impressed, and after like six months, he called us again and said. Eh, People, I don't know, but uh, I'm saving like like 50% of my tool cost. And then we say, okay, this is very nice. So we just put attention, put attention in that uh, case. And one year after, he told us, you know, this is incredible. Your machine is incredible. A, I saved 70% of the tool cost. But not only deceived 70% because he was getting better quality, you know, so you save maybe a scrap or something like that. So you save cost. You have a really, really interesting return on investment with this machine, with this option. I mean, not the, with not this machine, because we are talking about the condition to work with, with oil and graphite. Yeah, it's a fascinating story to me, and I'm very basic on my math. Again, you, you're better with numbers than I am, but if I think $100,000 for our smaller shops in tooling, and to imagine saving $70,000, right. you know, a million dollars in a shop, and you're saving, you know, $700,000. I mean, think about that math and how quickly a machine can pay itself off in that respect. But you mentioned right, right. something I think is important to understand because we know the quality. We know if our spindle is out of balance or if we don't have the, the right... Uh, system foundation, let's say, of the machine itself. That chatter is going to reduce the wear. The materials can destroy it a little bit as well. But you mentioned I'm doing less secondary operations. So overall, I got less cut time on said tool yeah, in yeah, order to right. make that happen. I want to move on to a subject that I, another one that's fascinating for me, Adrian. Yeah. And, and that's, mm -hmm. you mentioned to me a do-all machine. I so rarely hear a do-all machine, meaning the quality of this is so good. If I have an aluminum project come in, or aluminum for some of my folks out there, <laughs> aluminum project come in, no problem. If I have a steel project come in, no problem. If I have That's graphite, right. let's machine it wet and learn more about that. Or if I need to grind, you guys can actually grind on your machines yeah, as yeah, well. Yeah, right. Let's talk about this being a do-all machine and what it's capable of. Yeah, this this machine, like, like you see here uh, behind, is... Uh, it's uh, actually an exo grind machine. This is an MP, MP9 with uh, a grinding grinding uh, option. So you can you can also use this machine, this machine to to grinding. I mean, if you have all in one, normally you can get a machine only to grinding, or only to milling, or only to graphite. This, so this is, is true. This is this is our all in one, all in one machine. You can save cost to as. You, you, you have only one investment and, and, and everything. You can do everything 
So it's a, a question of your capacity. Maybe you will need two or three machines. Why not? Yeah. But the, with the best with the best results. Yeah, exactly that. Business. And when I think about that, Adrian, I think also about floor space. What if I don't have the floor space and I need to do it all in one? You know, we have so much more work coming in these days that are, you know, a high mix of different materials. But if Absolutely, we have the quality yes. yeah. that's built Absolutely. here, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's where you guys thrive for anyone out there who's just, they're betting on their future, right? They're making Absolutely. sure, not just the short term, but medium and long term as well. And don't forget, I mean, we you can you can automize this machine. Ah, yes, very you know, important. It's a very important because, uh, as you said, as it's it's at the moment, it's really difficult to find to find some people who really makes uh, make this work. So uh, we offer also the possibility to automate this machine to integrate it in a in a sale, completely sale. Um, maybe you will see the a little cell automation uh, and this is this is a really uh, versatile versatile machine yeah that's also important to understand because going back to what we were just discussing if you have a do-all machine and you have a high mix and you're changing materials and changing right. jobs or even a hot job comes in that a customer needs yesterday all of this can be done through automation and precision and that's Absolutely. your goal isn't yeah, it yeah and and you have only one control only one person, one machine, many customers, many customers. And it's I, a big deal. It's a big deal, right? It, absolutely a yeah. big deal. And I just have to bring up that I brought up to you uh, micron level, and then we brought yeah, up no, no, sub no, no, micron not, level, right? Not micron. Don't, don't forget, we are talking not about micron, but nanometers. Nano, I mean, yes. <laughs> in a surface, in the first surface, we talk right now about nanometers. And this nanometer surface, you get this nanometer surface with this with this solution. Nanometers. Do you yeah. know what nanometers is? I, I think you know what what it is. I know what it is, but I can't see it with my own eye. I, <laughs> yeah, I need help I from some of our, our metrology <laughs> friends out there in order yeah, to make yeah, that yeah. work. But yeah. yes, my friends out there, when you're looking for a machine and you really just want to take all of that work to the next level. When you have customers calling, you're like, I wish I could do that, or I can do it, but it's gonna take me a lot of secondary, third processes, maybe polishing to get to that point. It comes straight off of the machine here, ready to go, 70%, we're talking about that. Nanometers, we're talking about that. Automation, we're talking about that. So if you wanna learn more, give a shout out to my friends at Exeron. Give my Definitely. buddy Adrian a call. They're happy to answer any questions you have. Of course, I'm here in Germany today. I have a home in the US, but this is for anyone around the world and also for the YCM Alliance. Those are my friends in the US as a partnership as well. Adrian, you've done an amazing job today. Thank you, you for too. joining Thank me on camera much, and explaining how this works to the audience. 70%. I can't get over it. 70%. 70%. <laughs> I can't believe it.